good morning, my friends. Hopefully the uh, heater's not too loud. Um, it's actually it's getting cold here in Michigan for the fall season. Here in Michigan, it's always wacky. Period, like the weather. So, but I got up early enough this morning before work to uh, make some breakfast. And I'm very interested in this today. I went to uh, Dollar Tree and got some food yesterday. And I seen that they uh, they sell there's a whole bunch of random like frozen goods. I knew they sold frozen stuff. I never really looked into it too much. But they had steak in there, ribeye steak. So, and uh, bacon. Brew high steak. Cheeseburger, uh, burger patties. I'll have that for lunch. And some uh, cheese omelet thing. Jimmy Dean. I mean, none of the, these things existed at Dollar Tree, so let's uh, cook them up and try them out. I'm trying to get better about cooking more in the van. So I always have to remember to wipe stuff down. Because I don't cook in the van much, so it gets a little dusty in the meantime. And I know I still haven't really given you guys a proper van tour. That is to come. Forgot my damn spatula, so there's that. <laughs> but it's just me eating, so it don't matter. See, so, yeah, I figured, figured I'd uh, check out Dollar Tree for some cheap eating, and I found all this stuff. Like last night, they I because I found uh, some of that minute rice, ready to go rice. It's like jalapeno rice, rice. And then I found some uh, chicken in a can, but it was chicken and gravy in a can. It had Dollar Tree. So I got a good amount of stuff for at least a day or two for I don't know, twenty nine bucks. Not too bad. Not too bad. I guess there's someone on uh, TikTok, Dollar Tree Dinners or something like that, and she makes a whole bunch of good meals for super cheap. I'm going to look her up and try to get some ideas off her. Yeah, like, that's good enough for me. Good, good, good. Mm, so excited. So excited. I just can't hide it. Next, do the omelet. And this is already pre-cooked, as you can see. Actually, I'm gonna throw the steak on too. And garlic salt is all you need. Oh, that's all I do. I mean, sometimes I throw lorries on there or I'll eat other ways, but when I'm cooking, it just, I just like the uh, garlic salt. And I like mine medium, medium rare. It's already smelling super good. I got this all from Dollar Tree. Look how good that looks. Damn. Also, another thing I forgot. Damn. Fork and steak knife. 
That's all right. I'll use my hands. Damn. All cooked right there. In my van. Got a little smoky, so I opened the door. People at work gonna be walking by like, ooh, that smells good. Damn. <laughs> Today we're at Mount Morris High School where I graduated. They invited us alumni football players back to celebrate 100 years of Panther football. I got to see a lot of friends I haven't seen in years, and it was great seeing them all. Just clean off the grill, finally. Need to do this a little bit more often. So as you've seen, I, uh, you know, cooked some breakfast. But that was from a few days ago. And, uh, yeah. And then I just cooked this, uh, I'll show you in a second. Some ground turkey, um, chopped uh, peppers, onions, and portobello mushrooms in this stuff. Parmesan garlic sauce. Same thing as B does basically, just Walmart's version. <laughs> so damn good. Oh, it turned out so great. It's gonna be my lunch for work tomorrow. During work and after work. <laughs> but I figured I'd bust the camera out while I'm uh, doing some actual van life stuff, cleaning. <laughs> so yes, I clean. I really haven't shown anything like this before. Just clean the old Coleman. hanging out gotta work tomorrow and then uh work more on the van i got some stuff i'm gonna put in um i got a diesel heater pretty stoked for that but as i got the diesel heater like i got some lighting and stuff i gotta order different lights the stuff i'd like to have isn't gonna work but um so I'm going to order some different ones probably next few days. But the thing that really sucks, my little old Jackery 300. What I was going to plug in lights to. That's why I've been plugging lights into. Um, and I was going to, you know, share the power with that in the 1500 for the diesel heater. Because I don't think it's going to draw that much power between that and the fridge fridge being my biggest thing that runs right now well you know continuously i mean but the damn 300 stopped working i don't even know why i charged it fully and then i went to plug everything in and turn it on nothing not a damn thing works on it by contact to jackery um and they told me so i mean it didn't fix my problem but if it could fix your problem if you have a jackery they said hold the display button for 10 seconds it resets the battery and they oh cool they didn't fix it unfortunately but, but hey if you have a problem with your jackery uh try holding that display button for 10 seconds it might help you but jackery being awesome like they are they're gonna take care of me they want me to sit they're gonna they want me to send my jackery in and they're gonna try and fix it. And if they can't fix it, I get a new one. So that's cool. I am down for that. I mean, I hope they fix mine. I have the stickers and everything, like Weirdos United on it and everything. So that'd be cool. But I mean, if they can't and I get a new one, it won't be bad either. <laughs> but I mean, it's only two years old and I told them that. So that's, it definitely shouldn't have happened, but things happen, wear and tear either way. So definitely as I've been cooking in here and doing stuff in here more, I mean, I do love my van already. Short time in here, but still, I love it. But I wish it was a higher roof van. Because I mean, I try to keep my uh, back and everything as straight as I can when I'm doing stuff, but... It's a lot harder than you think. And then my back just starts hurting and I have to sit down. 
but that's all right. It's gonna work. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my um, the uh, Oktoberfest battles I did. They were a lot of fun to do. In delicious beer to drink. Shut that now. So, I think it sucks about having that open and recording and talking. There's a little bit of an echo. Got me a little sink. A little, it collapses while I'm done using it. Works great. Ten bucks at Walmart. Great purchase. And I know I still haven't done the uh, van tour. I will. Maybe if I get the stuff done, I want to do this weekend. But as you can see, I got a new sign. Cheers. Daily deals. I love that store. So thank you for whoever, whoever returned this sign. This neon sign. Because it works great in my van. <laughs> And as you can see, it gives off really good lighting. So that's pretty much all I have running. I have another little light up there, but. Wipe down the old table first. Pick you guys up. <laughs> A little cleaner. We have my garbage. <laughs> my lunch for the next day or two. Probably just eat it all tomorrow. Just make sure it doesn't go bad or anything. Get another beer out. Drinking this uh, Lullington Vanilla Jitter Bean, Lullington Bay Brewing Company. It's uh, in Lullington, Michigan. I'm not. It's up by uh, Lake Michigan. Another brewery on the list to go to. All right, dude skis. Just got to FedEx. Um, I think I said another part of this video. My little ex Jackery Explorer 300 stopped working, and I got I got a hold of Jackery, and they told me to ship it out to them and they're gonna try and fix it and they can't they can send me a new one and got a little box up right here fedex said they'd uh print out the label for me because i don't have a way to print that out so i'll keep you updated on that <laughs> so this video just <laughs> all over the place honestly um, I'm just trying not to be a bad YouTuber and uh, pick up my damn phone. Pick up my camera. Today we got a photo shoot. Don't know if I'm going to show it or not. If they're cool with it, you know, maybe I will. But either way, that's what we're doing today. Busting out the camera during these beautiful fall colors. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Just got done with my uh, my friend's family photo shoot. And went and did some grocery shopping. Now I'm about to meal prep some food for the week. Trying to stay away from my fast food. And uh, eat better. Well, I keep doing it and then I fall off. Back and forth, so let's see if I can stay on this time. And right now I'm enjoying my friends. I just did a photo shoot for it. Got me some beer. Right Brain Brewing Company. Cherry Pie Hole. It's pretty good. It's a it's an amber ale. It's 5.4% of the alcohols. It is really good, honestly. It's really drinkable. You can sit in here and crush several of them. 
Well, it doesn't have a very good cherry pie taste to it. So it's just a typical amber ale, but it's very smooth. It's crushable. And I gave it like a, well, I still have to put it on there, but a 3.5 out of 5 on, um, on tap, just because it says it's brewed with whole pies, but I don't really get that. Maybe a little bit on the, on the aftertaste on the on the back there but that's about it but let's get to cooking as everything falls <laughs> okay. I know they're clean but give it a little wipe down no I did have one of those uh pans that you break the the handle folds and everything that thing just everything sticks to it no matter what so I figured give me an actual not stick pan you gotta figure a good place to put it so basically what I'm trying to do cut out as much carbs as I can minus the beer obviously <laughs> but uh yeah I'm mainly gonna do like meat dairy stuff um fruit is what I'm gonna try and stick to a good friend of mine does it and he he's in great shape and lost a lot of weight from doing it so we'll see what happens maybe that I put it out on YouTube maybe I'll stick to it <laughs> and for this week what I'm gonna do Gonna cook up some uh, some ground turkey. Um, I'm gonna throw cheese in it and some garlic salt, and then throughout the week, every day I have different like buffalo sauce, and then I have garlic parm stuff. Change it up a little bit, try to keep it interesting. So I like different foods, and I get bored if I eat the same thing. So I'm trying to just make it simple. Can't find our damn long lighter. But the little lighter works just as good. I like these little wooden spoons and spatula. Another find at Daily Deals. <laughs> Love that store. I got a few different things. I got one of these. That thing is awesome. I love it. Ten bucks on Amazon. Freaking ten dollars. Hopefully it's not too sunny. That should be a little better. <laughs> Maybe. And it's just me eating it, so. Yeah, cut that, it doesn't matter. I gotta give me some nice scissors and stuff in here. The good thing about cooking like this today, I don't really have to worry about like opening all the windows and the damn van. It gets hot in there until I can get me uh, one of those uh, Max Air vents or something. Well, eventually I'll get me all that stuff. 
Got the diesel heater. I just got to get it put in. I've been watching videos, trying to learn how to do that. Decide where I want to put it because I got to cut a hole in the floor and into the through the van. Yeah, because I was going to try, I was trying to decide what kind of sauce I want to put in this today for all week, but if I just leave it plain in my containers all week, I can just add whatever sauce I want before I throw it in the microwave. Yeah, that sounds like a solid plan. because I have a, like a smaller burner on this thing or what but it seems like turkey takes a while to cook I've only cooked turkey a handful of times in my life I've had plenty of it Actually, I need to see if they have a, I need to get a lid. Maybe that'll help. Yeah, so the diesel heater, I just got to figure out where I want it. So I was just going to put it anywhere and put the exhaust and stuff out the window. But the thing I got, it goes, it's at the very bottom. So I don't think I'm going to do that. Like I said, this video is all over the place. I have been slacking on getting content out to you guys. I've been recording. I just haven't been putting together in a video. But obviously this is during Halloween. We had a great time over at the parents. My sister did all this. And my dad just setting everything up. It started snowing. It was really cold. But we still got a good amount of trick-or-treaters. Had a lot of cool stuff. So how, I hope everyone had a happy Halloween. Check out Jack Skellington here. Just hanging out. I had to mute the music. Because of YouTube. Copyright and stuff. I'll find something put it on here. With my voice. <laughs> but yep. Oh, this is Phil. My dude Phil. 12 foot skeleton. <laughs> cool dude. Look at him. Nah. I, I say Phil right there too. But music's going. So that's why it's muted right now and you have to listen to me talk with this voiceover instead <laughs> Street Walmart. This place is fantastic. Great Lake eats and treats. So good food. Such good food. Damn, look at that delicious food. Taco Tuesday. Great Lakes eats and treats. Oh, so good. Let's see how it is. I haven't had the tacos yet. I had the loaded fries before and they were delicious. That's a good looking taco. Mm. Delicious. So good. 
I know I said I'm eating, but I'm trying to work out and eat better, but I seen the guys post on Facebook about Taco Tuesday. And I could not resist. I also kick the ass in the gym and then go get a steak afterwards for my post workout meal. Get all that protein and goodness and that steak. Yeah, check these guys out. Good ass food. Alright, so I'm at Comic Con once again. They do the big ones in May. Uh, then this is just kind of like the fall version, I guess. I don't know. But still, Comic Con, I'm a nerd. So I'm coming. Again, uh, my sister's working it this year. So I came to kind of just hang out, bullshit with her. And uh, she is doing like line control, whatever, for Tom Cavanaugh. Harrison Wells, a.k.a. The Reversed Flash on the awesome CW show, The Flash. And I got my first ever autograph. Oh, yeah. So excited for this. And then I was walking away because I, I was working with one of the last people. He had, he's catching his flight here soon. So he had to take off like ASAP. But I'm mad I had a missed opportunity. I didn't think about it. I... Because he's like, I'll personalize it or whatever. I'm like, yeah, just put it to JR. You know, that's cool. And, you know, hello, JR. He has a gun, you know, the rifle. But I was walking away to the, go and put it in the car to protect it. And I was like, damn it. I should have had him. For, what's up, dude, skis? <laughs> Missed opportunity, if you, if you ask me. Fuck. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know what part of the video this is going in, but I had to throw it in there. And how I'm a dum-dum. Damn it. I said something about it. Before. I'll put it on my YouTube channel. <laughs> He's like, oh, that's cool. I gotta start bringing my stick. I have stickers. I need to start bringing them in. And giving them to people. I wonder if a celebrity had someone give them their YouTube sticker. Or YouTube sticker stuff or whatever. New stickers, though. <laughs> yeah. Yep. So I'm laying here. Um, editing this video it's been a couple weeks in the making since my last one last one I did was the uh, Hawking Hills State Park video I believe but you see me talk about my diesel heater still haven't got that in um, but the main thing I figured I'd show you before you know I end this video A new, new 300, new Explorer 300. Jackery is amazing. The customer service, this company is just downright amazing. One of the best I've ever, ever dealt with. Especially being, I mean, they're pricey, but they work great. And they do what they can to help you. Like, I, I got this back in 2021. So I have a little over two years now. And... As I said earlier, it stopped working. And I told them that, and they didn't hesitate. All they said, send it in. We'll try and fix it. If we can't, we'll give you a new one. And new one. And it works fantastic. I had my lights plugged into it. I charged my phone off of it. And I got my 1500 back here for bigger things. And can use that for the diesel heater. But we're fully back in power. So I'm super excited. And I got some other cool stuff lately. Got me an Oxhorn uh, mug. Love this thing. Put my put my sticker on it. <laughs> Had to. And then some other stuff going on. But we'll talk about that in, in uh, another video. I still owe you guys a van tour. Um, but as you can see, I got some little stuff going on right now, which I, that was an earlier in the video lit up. But I'm going to end it right here and start playing the next video. Van tour. Maybe that will be the next one. I got to get that one done. But thanks for watching. Come back for the next one. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you're not already. And I will check you later, dudeskies. You know what? How about Jackery sends us out? <laughs>